guys, welcome to Gaming Console Tech. I am Ash. There's not many controllers which fit my big, beefy hands, and basically that came to a conclusion to me. Now, I've not done this before, so I'm going to get straight into it. This is going to be my review of the Xbox 360 controller. So guys, what can be said about the Xbox 360 controller except for the fact that it is pretty much brilliant in every way? Honestly, it's one of the more comfortable controls I've ever used, so you can see why it's so beloved. Now, you've got all your face buttons, your X, B, Y, A, D-pad, thumbsticks, and your start and select, and also the big silver button in the middle is obviously your one to turn it on, along with your bumper buttons and also your L and R triggers. On the back, you've got an input for play and charge. However, I don't actually need that because there is a reason. That will all come clear in just a little while. And on the bottom, you have an input for a little keyboard and also your headphones, which obviously you'll need if you're going to be playing online. Now on the back, you do have my play and charge kit, which honestly, this is a rechargeable battery pack. There's nothing other that I can say about that. I prefer this just because it is a lot simpler and obviously a lot easier when you're playing games. You can just dock it down and then have done with it. And guys, here is the reason that that battery pack comes in so damn handy, because you have this. Now, honestly, I prefer this just because it's a hell of a lot easier and it just makes gaming easier with this. And a lot of controls you're not able to do it with. So guys, here's me using the Xbox 360 controller, playing a bit of Halo, and may I just say I am actually playing it extremely bad right now and <laughs> that's not a joke um, before I did this footage I died three or four times and believe it or not that's only on the first level and generally found out I was playing on legendary so yeah it's, it was all fun that's all I'm gonna say to that but playing the Xbox 360 controller it is a really comfortable controller and honestly everything is within reach while you're playing the game it's just absolutely awesome to use as for the trigger buttons, obviously on this game you're using the triggers all the time, so they're the main buttons I tested in this footage and honestly they work brilliantly well, as probably you all know, but like I say, it's just an absolutely fantastic controller in general and it's great to use. So there you go guys. Now, like I said at the beginning of this video, big beefy hands, so this controller really does set out towards the rest and it really does fit just so well everything is within reach without stretching anything or doing anything or you know just generally being a comfortable controller to use so hope you enjoyed this review hopefully i'm hoping so in the meantime guys thanks for watching and i shall see you guys in the next video if you haven't already subscribe like and comment on what your favorite controller is down at the bottom or even your worst let's face it there are some really really bad controllers out there and I could probably mention a few now, but I'm not going to. I'll leave that to you guys. So thank you very much for watching, and I shall see you guys again soon. Have a good one, and happy gaming.